Hey guys, welcome to my home for the night. As promised, I'm filming here from Sanye State Forest. We're going to do a overnight. Let me give you a little bit of a, a little look around. Here's my hammock setup. There's the Yukon Outfitters tarp. There is my hammock setup couple ridge lines there. There you see my guardian Eno Guardian bug nut all set up around the equip hammock. Had a little bit of trouble with the tarp because it doesn't it's too long for it's longer than between these trees. But that's alright, we made it work. At least one side's tight. this side over here. So that was the first thing I did when I got here. We set up the sleep system. I hung my pack from the tree. And on the other side, I set up my tripod with some paracord and a tail, cleared out an area for the fire. There's my platform, a little bit of bark there. Um, MSR pot, Stanley Canteen, macaroni and cheese, little tin there with some flint and steel and char cloth. There you see my thermocell to keep the mosquitoes away. That thing does a great job. Over here, My H2O Condor cook kit there. My ditty bag for the MSR pot. The cover I'm using is my canteen cover. Uh, some leather gloves to play in the fire. I have a yellow poncho in case it rains. I have Nesmix Woodcraft and Camping. And my e-cig, my vaping device there right on top tarp over there on the ground. So what I thought I would do is let's put the uh, canteen to the test. I was going to make some macaroni and cheese in the MSR pot and I'm still going to do that but we're going to instead of hanging it on the tail here of our paracord for the tripod we're going to boil the water in the canteen and then get it into the Stanley MSR, pour it into the Stanley MSR pot and make the macaroni and cheese. So I hope you like the setup. There's my wood here. I've got my wood separated out in different piles. Over there you see my camera kit. So I'm gonna put you back over on the other side, guys, and we're gonna we're gonna have some fun here. All right, guys. So let's uh, let's play with a little flint and steel. But I think we'll go ahead and try out our new Mora 711 with getting a spark off it. Should be just fine. So I just whacked it right into the box this time, as opposed to holding it on the stone like we did the other time. And we've got a couple. You see that okay?
just going to set my twigs right on top of the brace, right on my platform here. So we'll get a little bit, little bit of a fire going here, guys, and then we're gonna throw on our Stanley Canteen and see how it boils. I'm gonna take the top off, of course. And then what I wanna do, I have an extra cotton shirt over there. And if it's still light out and we still have some time, I'm gonna make some char cloth in it, really put it to the test. Oh guys, it's about 86 degrees out today. Not bad at all for Western New York. It looks like we went pretty much from spring. We didn't have a spring. We went pretty much from cold weather, winter weather, right into pretty hot weather. So I cut off the webbing that came along with it and I could always tie it back on. That's not a big deal. Let's go ahead and set that right in the fire. See what we can get for a boil. And I have my leather gloves to get it out. And I also have my multi-tool, my uh, Gerber suspension, is it called? It's not a Leatherman, but it'll do. So I'll be right back, guys. We'll give you a little update. Okay, guys, just a little update. We're getting some bubbles in there. It's not to a boil yet. And I did want to put it to the best test I could. So just to recap, we went and put it directly in the fire. Then we'll see what happens. After it comes out, sorry about that. I'm just trying to see if we can get a closer look. Let's see what we got. Okay guys, I'm not sure if you can see that or not, but we are approaching a nice solid boil. So not too bad at all. Can you see that okay? So I got it pretty much completely wrapped up in the fire. 
put it to the best test we can. I am going to take this off and pour it into my macaroni. Let that steam and then we're going to throw some char cloth in this and make some char cloth with it. Be back guys.